Hey, okay, we're going to the university. Sorry, I'm just at a, a turning light. Um, I'm so hungry. I'm so glad I found something to eat. Um, I always had granola bars in your car. It helps. Okay, so I'm going to the university. I ended up finding another person to buy a textbook, so that's three. So that's like a hundred bucks today. So, yay. Um, sorry, let me chew. Anyways, I'm driving to the university. This is the first time I have been back to the university since January. I sold one textbook in January, and this is the first time I'm going back, which is, it's weird. It's super weird. Um, I don't have as much anxiety as I thought I was going to about kind of just going back, and I think that's good. I need to sort of desensitize myself to this because I don't really have to go back for any real reason in my like foreseeable future, but like, I don't like the idea that I'm gonna be like afraid to go a place just because like that's kind of where my anxiety, I guess, really started to get bad. I think I'm gonna stop at Sally's Beauty Supply. There's one kind of along my way back because I wanna get some, I think I was watching a video and it was like 30 grade toner. Is it, do you measure it by grades? I don't know, but like 30 toner um, because I really, like, I don't plan on going to a hairdresser for a while. Like, I love the girl who does my hair. I just punch myself in the face. But I don't love spending 200 plus dollars every time, you know? It's just, like, I could spend that money on literally anything else, and it would probably, like, matter more. That being said, I don't want my hair to look like shit, so I'm just trying to, since my hair is, like, light enough, I think I can go to box dye because that'll take it like three shades lighter. I'll just do like an all over sort of deal. And then I think I can just use like a toner. I've been watching a lot of YouTube videos about this. Like obviously if you're doing a drastic dye change, don't <laughs> do it at home because like you're gonna fuck up your hair. Like that's just how it's gonna go. You're just gonna fuck it up. But I mean, I'm, I'm light enough over most of my head and I'm okay with having like highlights and lowlights. I don't need it all to be one color. I don't need to like bleach it. I just kind of want to be able to fix up the roots and that's pretty much it. And then I know how to trim my hair. I would also like to get some like scissors at Sally's just because I have like sewing scissors. But like I've, I've also been watching YouTube videos about like trimming your hair at home. So I feel like I, I could do it. Like I'm pretty sure I could do it. And if I can't, like, what's the worst that's gonna happen? It's gonna look uneven for a week or two? Like, I don't give a fuck. So, <laughs> I'm just, I'm trying to really think of ways, as many ways as possible, to save as much money as possible. Um, and I think hair is a really good way to save $200 every three or four months. And I think that, I guess, just not buying clothes and appreciating what I have, I think that's been a big turning point for me, where it's just like, you don't need anything else, you're fine. Um, and then what else? There's, there's just a bunch of little things, like making coffee at home, or meal planning, which I have not gotten into as much as I probably should, but like, it's definitely something that I've sort of started. Like, I, at least I'm prepping snacks and stuff, which is where it used to get really bad, where I was like, I'm so hungry but also so lazy, so I guess I'm gonna go into town and buy something. So I sold the textbooks, I'm now at Sally's, and I'm gonna go and see if I can get my toner. Okay, so I went to Sally's, super nice, and also, hello cheap. Like, okay, tweezer man, tweezers, six dollars, what? I got another pair of tweezer man tweezers because I needed one. And I got a cheap pair of hair scissors, so there's that. And then I got, um, what is this? This is developer. And they said like three parts of this for this whole bottle or something. I don't know. But I also got a, a color charm toner, T18. We'll see how that works. So I'm going to probably wait for a while and not do it like in the next week or two because my hair still looks fine. But it's definitely something that I will be doing and I will be saving money. Oh. That was louder than I thought it was going to be. Hi, dear. So we slept in a little bit today. It is Saturday. I'll just keep you focused on him because I'm 
looking pretty rough. It's 1046 and I'm gonna go make some coffee. Well, hey there. So it is Saturday today, is it? Yes, okay. <laughs> I just remember how last vlog I could not get my days straight. Um, I appreciate all your guys' feedback. Why is the AC on? It's cold. Um, I appreciate your feedback from last vlog where I kind of asked if you want longer, shorter vlogs. I think the consensus is like like a 10 minute vlogs a couple times a week instead of like a good 15, 20 minute vlog maybe once a week. So cool, we'll do that then. Mom and I are headed off to the River Cree Casino to stay the night and we're seeing Eliza Schlesinger and I am so excited, one of my absolute favorite comedians. Um, she has two specials on Netflix, Freezing Hot and, oh my god, um, War Paint and they're both so good. So I'm super excited to see her live. Um, and Bracken's also going too, so I'm gonna see him, maybe do a little bit of gambling afterwards and <clears throat> I've saved up a little bit of uh, extra cash over the past couple of weeks, like I gave myself a cash budget and I haven't been spending all of it, so I have a little bit more than I thought I would to like gamble or buy drinks, so I'm just gonna have fun tonight. Okay, so we got to the hotel and then <laughs> we went downstairs and ate and gambled a little bit. I came here with $80 or so and let's see how much I have because I won quite a bit of money. So. I have 150, um, 170, 190, 210, 220. So I won quite a bit of money um, just from playing slots because I don't know how to do anything else. So now, anything that I do not spend today, um, I'm not going to go under $200. I'm going to leave with that money intact. But I have like, I don't know, 20 more dollars to play gambling, so I'm going to do that after the show. And I'm excited. I feel good about it. Um, oh, I'll show you the, the room. We're at the Marriott at the River Cree. So in here, there's the bathroom right here. It is. We've got the bathroom. Pretty standard. And the shower. I would turn you around, but I'm just too lazy to do that. So this is what we're doing. And then, that's my bed, obviously, because it's the fucking mess. And then here's our view, it's pretty. Lovely view of the parking lot. Um, oh, here. So, <laughs> our room's like as far as possible as it can get from the elevator, and I was telling mom how fun that's gonna be when we're both like plastered drunk. Guys, okay, no, I'm gonna, I'll be over here. <laughs> so it's like two in the morning. My mom is fucking wasted right now. I'm like a little drunk, but. <laughs> I was drinking. I, I won. I won big. I gotta actually count and see how much I won, but I have more money to go to my house fund because I'm not gonna spend it on anything stupid that I don't need. That's it. I, I have nothing else to tell you because I didn't really feel comfortable filming in the casino. And uh, I'm gonna get into bed. It's two in the morning. This is, everyone was joking about how boring I am. Yeah? Suck a dick. Look at how late it is. Oh my god, you guys, it was so much fun. The show is amazing. Eliza is hilarious. I'm so excited for her next special. It comes out on the 23rd of September. Watch it. Um, and then we just gambled and played blackjack and Bracken was here with his friend and we all went and played blackjack and it was so fun. And I was up like 200 bucks. So pretty solid evening. Oh, I'm gonna go down to the lobby as soon as mom gets back up and uh, get a Starbucks, and then we're gonna peace out, go home, nap. But can we just talk about how comfy these beds are? They're like a cloud. I enjoy sleeping on clouds. That's what I've learned here.